is tarawi 8 rak'at or tarawi 20 rak'at you know those people who ask me those who when eid comes and ramzan comes and they say no imam sahab eid is happening in saudi arab ramzan started in saudi arab 9th of arfa in saudi arab how come we are doing one day after so when they ask me this question 20 rakat is happening in Medina. 20 rakat is happening in Makkah. why you want to do it then it's not like it's, you want to follow saudi arab no 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 you just want ease if ease is here you will follow that if ease is there you follow that well anyways the first let me tell you where this misconception is coming of eight rakat ravi there is only one hadith where the misconception of eight rakat ravi is coming and in that hadith ravi is not even mentioned that hadith is narrated by Hazrat Aisha Sadiqa She was asked by her brother Abdul Rahman. He said, Tell me, oh my sister, how Rasulullah used to read his night prayer in Ramzan. So he said, Kaifa kanat salatu Rasulullah sallam fi Ramzan. Now listen to this, the answer of the Aisha Sadiqa She said, Fakalat, ma kana yazidu fi Ramadana wala fi ghairiha ala ihda aishrat rak'at. He did not pray more than 11 rak'at in Ramzan and through the year. Not just in month of Ramzan she's talking about. She said, fi Ramzana wala fi ghairiha. He used to read the maaz of 11 rakats in Ramzan and outside of the Ramzan as well. So it's Muharram, he's doing 11 rakat. In Rajab, he's doing 11 rakat. So she's not even talking about Ravi. She's talking about the Hajjad Nimaaz. Now let me tell you, Imam Bukhari has mentioned this hadith in book of Taravi and book of the Hajjud. What is the sunnah of Imam Bukhari is that he put one hadith in every section wherever he belongs to. So Taravi is a night prayer. Tahajjud is night prayer. He mentioned this hadith in Tabu Tahajjud and in Kitabu Taravi as well. But Imam Muslim will always use hadith where it belongs to. And Imam Muslim have only used this hadith in Kitabu Tahajjud, not in Kitabu Taravi. He only put this hadith in Kitabu Tahajjud. Has Prophet ever read 20 Rakat Taravi? Imam Baiki had narrated a hadith in Sunan Al Kubra from Hazrat Abdullah bin Abbas. Then An ibn Abbas in the Allah Ta'ala An Kana Nabi Yusulli Bi Shahri Ramadana Bi Ghairi Jamaatin Bi Ashreena Rakat Wal Witter 20 Rakat of Taravi and 3 Rakat of Witter Ravahu ibn Abi Shaiba wa Tabrani Anu Bahiki Anna Nabi Yusulli Salam Yusulli Fi Ramadana Ashreena Rakatan Siwal Witteri He used to read 20 Rakat of Taravi Siwal except Witter and that was the custom of all the Sahaba that was the custom of Abu Bakr Siddiq. That was the custom of Hazrat Umar Raziyallah Ta'ala Anhu. Why Hazrat Umar Raziyallah Ta'ala Anhu started 20 rakat namaz? Because of course he saw Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi reading 20 rakat. That's the reason he's doing 20 rakat. Is he bid'ati? You calling him bid'ati then? That he saw Rasulullah Sallallahu doing 8. He said, no, 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 I'm better than Rasulullah. Let me do 20 now. It make no sense why Abu Bakr did 20. Why Umar did 20? Basra, Kufa, Sham, everywhere 20 rakat was going on because Umar is the leader. There's a hadith actually. Mota Imam Malik. That kana nasu yakumuna fi zamani Umar ibn al-Khattab. The people used to read Taravi namaz. They used to stand in Taravi namaz in the time of Umar ibn al-Khattab. Fi Ramzana, bi thalathim wa aishirina raka'a. Three and twenty. Three for Witter, twenty for Taravi. It make no sense when people say, no, Imam Sahib, but this is eight. Y'all go and look about eight raka'a. There is no Taravi mentioned there. Aisha Siddiqa is saying that whole through year, Rasulullah used to read eight raka'a of the Hajjud and three raka'a of Witter. This is how eleven raka'a. Twenty, go towards Abu Bakr, go towards Umar. All the Sahaba, Aimai Arba, fatwa is on this. Twenty, it says that Ajma'u Sahaba ala anna Taravi is shiruna raka'a. That the companions by unanimously, without disagreement, agreed that Taravi is twenty. Rakat. Anyone who reads eight, he never fulfills sunnat e muqtada. He will be held questionable on the day of judgment. Right? So you have to read twenty taravi rakat. Then you have fulfilled the sunnat e muqtada.